The pack prevailed against the Bears Sunday night, 45 to 30. Aaron Rodgers threw for 341 yards and four scores. The Bucks beat the Bills in overtime. Tom Brady found Brashad Perryman for the game-winning score and his 700th career touchdown pass, 33-27 the final. The Niners won in overtime as well, thanks to Jimmy G finding Brandon Ayuk from 12 yards out. They bested the Cincinnati Bengals 26-23. The Chiefs rolled past the Raiders 48-9. Patrick Mahomes 258 and a couple of scores. The Cowboys took care of the Washington football team 27-20. Rookie Micah Parsons, a pair of sacks and a pair of sacks. lined up with just 10 players lay a game penalty to begin the game against the Lions to honor their fallen wide. Demarius Thomas. Denver won the game 38 to 10. This has been NFL Network Map on the Westwood One Radio Network. With the holidays in full swing, join in the festivities at Lowe's Winterfest. Start by getting $20 off a Craftsman 20 volt max drill kit. Was $79, now $59. Or Blackstone Riddles with an everyday low price starting at $149. Make more holiday at Lowe's. Home to any budget, home to any possibility. Ballot through 1215, while supplies last, U.S. only. Napa know-how. At Napa, get great deals on a variety of craftsman tools all month long for those DIYers in your family. Like the 20-volt drill driver combo with a battery and charger for just $119. With a deal like that, we're putting unfinished projects on notice. Looking at you, loose doorknob. That's the drill driver combo, just $119. Quality parts, helpful people. That's Napa know-how. Napa know-how. At participating Napa Auto Parts stores, NapaOnline.com. While supplies last. Offer ends 12 31 21. We are the Imperial Valleys, AM 1230, KXO, El Centro, California. So, how was your weekend? <laughs> ah, this past weekend, the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix, the last Formula One race of the year. And Mercedes was expected to win. They didn't. They filed a number of protests. Yeah, we'll see how that one comes out. And if you noticed, Fiat doesn't enter Formula One. No, Fiat's not in the Formula One races. Well, mainly because every time it comes into the pits, they have to jack up the tires and change the car. <sighs> Let's see what's happening. We've got birthdays. We do. I, and we will celebrate. Uh, not only the birthdays, but your friends and family, as uh, they say. And a reminder, Santa, yeah, Saint Nick, yeah, you, yeah, be here Tuesday through Friday from 4 till 6 p.m. In the, okay, no, today through Thursday. Okay, I don't love this right. Right. Um, and uh, kids can talk to Santa. All they have to do is call and uh, talk to Santa. Yeah, we're uh, of the calls may be played on the air on AM30 or FM 1.5 or KXO YouTube channel or on our Facebook page. So, uh, great opportunity for the kids. Visit Santa Claus by telephone. I'm going to be right here in our studio. I'm so excited. Yes. Let's see. We have uh, birthdays. Big shot birthdays. Nick Van Dyke is 96 years old today. Uh, actor, singer, Ben Davidson is a actor, Kathy Garver. Is seventy six. I believe she was the one of the the daughters. In fact, uh, singer Ted Nugent from Detroit is seventy three. Jeff Baxter Skunk, of, uh, the Doobie Brothers and Steely Dan is seventy three. Actor Wendy Malick is seventy one. Singer Steve Forbert sixty seven. Singer Morris Day of the Time sixty five. What time? Uh, actor Steve Buscemi, 64. Actor Johnny Whitaker, also the little brother from Family Affair, 62. 
Actor, comedian Jamie Foxx, 54. Actor Lucia Struess is 54. Actor James Kyson Lee, 46. Actor Kimmy Balmelero is 42. Actor Chelsea Hertford, 40. Actor Michael Socha is 34. Actor Marcel Spears, 33. Taylor Swift is 32. Actor Maisie Stella is 18. We've got local birthdays coming up. If you're looking for the perfect gift, it's the Peanut Patch in Yuma. The Peanut Patch. They're open Monday through Saturdays, 9 a.m. till 5 p.m. Yuma time. And at the Peanut Patch, you'll find homemade chocolates. They also make their very own fresh English toffee, plain or covered in milk chocolate, pecan turtles from a special recipe, chocolate-covered raisins, almonds, coffee beans. They do cinnamon bears. It's the Peanut Patch in Yuma. They've got a great variety of gift packs and you can ship them to friends and loved ones all over the world. They'll take care of it for you. The Peanut Patch in Yuma. You want directions? Google the Peanut Patch and follow the directions. The Peanut Patch in Yuma. Making holiday shopping so easy. We have happy birthday wishes for Alexia Cano, Maria Hernandez, Heather Manas, Diana Renteria, Alexis de la Rosa, Angela Sanchez, Raquel Godinez, Regina Villanueva, Gwen Sidhu, Jesus Reyes, Julio Cesar Cuevas, Nicole Morlet, Sean Irvin, and Kevin Vega. Happy birthday from KXO. And of course, Many happy returns. Oh, boy. Foot Wines has a new wine out. Are you ready for this? Barefoot Wines new Oreo Thins Red Blend. <laughs> Sold for making its on debut last. Yeah, the uh, company's bottle of red wine that came with a package of Oreo treats sold out in less than 30 minutes. <laughs> Oh, well, a, a bottle of wine with Oreo cookies? Yeah, of course. It's the perfect gift for the soccer mom on the go. Oh, boy. Uh, well, hey, you know, whatever it takes. Uh, and let's, oh, a 15-year-old boy has become the youngest ever graduate from the University of Nevada, Las Vegas. Now, I understand to celebrate, yeah, the kid's going to go to Disney World, but that's if his parents let him. Uh, uh, let's hope so. Uh, we've got news. Are you ready? We've got a look at World in California News headlines brought to you this morning by Lock Air Conditioning. They are your year-round comfort specialist for sales, for service. You call the experts at Lock Air Conditioning and heating and custom sheet metal. CBS News Special Report. The death toll in Kentucky has just gone up to 64 after a burst of tornadoes tore through six states over the weekend. Governor Andy Bashir speaking this hour says he expects that number to go higher. We believe it'll certainly be above 70, maybe even 80. But again, with this amount of damage and rubble, it may be a week or even more before we have uh, a, a final count. He says 105 people are still unaccounted for among the thousands of buildings flattened, a candle factory in Mayfield. This man lives nearby. When I looked out the window, things were flying, and it's like I've never seen a tornado before. It was a little scary. More than 200 miles away, Carla Cope's son Clay, a Navy veteran, was killed when a tornado hit an Amazon facility in Edwardsville, Illinois. I wouldn't expect anything less of him to go back and try to help people to get to where they needed to be. CBS News Special Report. I'm Deborah Rodriguez. Become a Lock Air Conditioning VIP customer and get special pricing on cooling and heating tune-ups all year long. Call today to become a Lock Air Conditioning VIP customer at 760 93 
three L O C K E. That's seven six zero nine three L O C K E. Lock VIPs receive discounted service and maintenance, discounted repairs, and priority service with prompt service. Lock Air Conditioning is your local York dealer, but they repair it all. So when the need arises, don't hesitate to call Lock Air Conditioning at seven six zero nine three L O C K E. That's seven six zero nine three L O C K E. Lock, the only name in air conditioning for over forty years. York, install with confidence. Contractors license number six nine six two one six. California headline news. A man taken into custody after shots were fired in Hollywood Sunday night near where a large crowd had gathered to water late Mexican singer Vicente Fernandez. The shots appearing to come from an apartment complex across the street. All of a sudden we start hearing uh, gunshots. We heard about six of them. Uh, we were all like, you know, panicking because we don't know what direction they were coming from or where they were shooting at. Dozens had gathered to the singer's star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. The 81-year-old performer died Sunday in Mexico. No one was hit by the gunshots. Amidst the devastation left by a string of in the Midwest. West. First responders from across the country, including California, are stepping up to help. A couple of the elite members of FEMA's incident support teams here headed to the region. Catastrophic damage, not to be understated by any means. We're only seeing the tip of the iceberg right now. Mark Navo, a former FEMA presidential appointee. An atmospheric river shifting course over the weekend, bringing more stormy weather southward than was predicted. Wind advisories in effect for a number of areas. Rain in much of the northern region today. Jeff Scott, California News. World in California news headlines brought to you this morning by Lock Heating and Air Conditioning. Yeah, keep warm and toasty. If your uh, your heat pump isn't working right, call Lock Air Conditioning today. This is CBS News business analyst Jill Schlesinger. Do you want to be a hero for the holidays? How about getting your loved one a new iPhone? That's right. Pure Talk has iPhone 12 starting at just $4.79 through the end of the year. And sure, they have 13s too. Switch to Pure Talk. Great nationwide 5G coverage. Yes, the same coverage as the big guys, but the family saves over $800 a year. Now that's just, there's no need to overpay for Verizon, AT&T, or T-Mobile. Plus, with Pure Talk's 30-day risk-free guarantee, you've got nothing to lose. Unlimited talk, text, and 6 gigs of data is just 30 bucks a month. And like I said, the iPhone 12, just 479 From your cell phone, dial pound 250 and say Jill 50, and you'll save an additional 50% off your first month. Plus, save on a new phone. That's pound 250, say Jill 50. Pure talk is simply smarter wireless. Some restrictions apply. See site for details. It's page one of the local news. Page one is a service of Quick Lane Tire and Auto Centers in Brawley and El Centro. Before you head out on that, uh, well, holiday road, head into Quick Lane Tire and Auto Centers and tell them you want the works. Right now, you can save a chunk of money on the works at Quick Lane in Brawley and El Centro. Well, a weather system will bring breezy conditions to the area beginning early tomorrow morning and lasting through uh, the night. Wind gusts of 25 to 35 miles an hour will be very common with potentially stronger gusts of 45 to 55 miles an hour for a few hours late Tuesday night and early Wednesday morning. There is a uh, good chance of uh, snow in the mountains between here and San Diego and uh, a 60% plus chance of precipitation in the Imperial Valley. You should start seeing some of the increasing clouds uh, today. Well, the IID and partners have broken ground on a new project. It's an upgrade to IID's 230 kilovolt S line. The line is one of the Imperial Irrigation District's major transmission lines. The project is an effort to maintain reliable energy service while boosting the ability to import and export power. The uh, event was held in Sealy. And uh, currently the line serves the, as the primary path for the import and export of power through IID into California and Arizona energy markets. The 18 mile long S line transmission network connects the Imperial Valley and El Centro substations. KXO News Time 
is 743. Quick Lane Tire and Auto Centers in Brawley and El Centro service all makes and all models, and you never need an appointment. Quick Lane Tire and Auto Centers ready to take care of your automotive service needs. Tires, brakes, batteries, AC service, alignments, lube oil and filter change, and more. Quick Lane Tire and Auto Centers on Imperial Avenue next to Food for Less in El Centro. And in the Brawley Auto Center, Highway 86 and Julia Drive. Well, the Imperial Irrigation District Board of Directors will reorganize the reorganization uh, scheduled for December 21st. The public meeting will begin at 1 p.m. Uh, Board President James Hanks is expected to pass the gavel to Division Two Director J.B. Hamby. Uh, the mystery, the question, who will be selected as Vice President of the Board? And... Uh, it's Chips for Kids Toy Drive. The CHA Toy Drive, it's underway. The drive hosted by the California Highway Patrol. They're asking the public to help make a difference in a child's life. You can do that by donating a new unwrapped toy before December 17th. There are two drop-offs at Walgreens in El Centro and at the CHP office on Highway 86 in Imperial. The uh, city of Calipatria will hold a city council meeting 6 p.m. tomorrow evening. It's a Zoom meeting and uh, gets underway again at 6 p.m. That's it for page one of the local news. Page one, a service of Quick Lane Tire and Auto Centers in Brawley and Del Centro. Quick Lane, they service all makes and all models. And you never need an appointment. Let's talk about it. Bringing community mental health issues to your radio. Listen each Sunday morning to KXO AM 1230 at 7 a.m. Or on Sunday evening at 7 p.m. on FM 107.5. Or log on to KXORadio.com for a podcast of the show in its entirety. This program is produced by the Public Affairs Department of KXO AM 1230 and FM 107.5. Let's Talk About It is presented as a public service of Imperial County Behavioral Health Services. Page two of the local news is brought to you by David H. West Insurance Services. You can see David or Jose. They've got answers to your questions about life insurance, health insurance, auto and home insurance as well. Santa is going to be very, very busy. The uh, city of uh, Brawley will provide Santa Claus tour of the city. And that will begin this evening and run through the 16th. Beginning at 6 p.m. each night, the Brawley Fire and Police Departments will escort Santa Claus through the streets of Brawley for our residents and visitors. It's the second year they've hosted the activity. Well, last year, Santa saw thousands of smiling faces over two days. So this year, they've slowed down a bit, going to spread the cheer over four days. And... Santa will also be cruising El Centro. The city of El Centro and El Centro Fire Department hosting the event beginning today, running through the 19th. Santa Claus will El Centro on a fire truck each evening starting at 5.30 p.m. Santa and his helpers will be going through various neighborhoods each evening. So, and Irons, and that means Santa will be nearby. Come on out and wave to Santa. And uh, the uh, route Santa will follow, you can go to the City of El Centro um, Facebook page or website and find the map. And uh, the uh, Imperial Valley College uh, Board of uh, Trustees will hold their regular meeting Wednesday at 6 p.m. The meeting uh, gets underway at 6, closed session at 6.05, return to open session at 7 p.m. The uh, meeting available on Zoom. And uh, Abate 38 is getting ready for their... Uh, Imperial Valley Los Niños Toy Drive. The event benefits the kids of the valley. Um, 
The uh, abate group will gather at Coin Power Sports on South 4th Street in El Centro at 9 o'clock Saturday morning. And uh, they'll uh, be raising uh, toys and gift cards uh, for uh, kids who are less fortunate. Their theme, Bikers Won't Forget Kids. And uh, we mentioned Santa will be busy. Well, Santa will be very busy. He'll be here at KXO from 4 p.m. till 6 p.m. Monday through Thursday this week. Kids can call Santa, 760-352-2029, and visit with Santa on the air. Now, well, we'll be recording the calls. Some of the calls may be played on the air or on the KXO YouTube channel or on our Facebook page. And again, that's uh, today through Thursday, 352-2029. 29 is the number. That's it. Uh, we've got a look at the weather coming up. KXO News Time, 749. Nice to explore your options when it comes to buying insurance, no matter what you're looking for. David H. West Insurance Services offers it all. And being an independent broker, we have many companies to choose from. We continue providing Medicare, life, and health plans, and now offer auto, home, and commercial insurance. David H. West Insurance Services can find the right insurance to fit your needs and budget. And best of all, a staff who cares about you. So don't hesitate to pick up the phone and call David H. West Insurance Services at 760-352-3411. That's 352-3411 for a free insurance review. 352-3411. According to the National Weather Service, clouds will to increase today, but quiet and seasonably mild weather will persist just a bit longer. By tomorrow morning... Thick clouds arrive with widely scattered showers possible. A strong low pressure system and cold front will sweep the area Tuesday evening and overnight with a period of rain expected along with windy kinds at times. Look for quiet and cooler weather to resume by Wednesday afternoon. 66 the high day, 36 hour low today. Increasing clouds with a high near 67. Wind becoming east-southeast about 5 miles an hour this afternoon. Tonight, cloudy. Then gradually becoming cloudy. Look for a low around 45. North-northwest wind about 5 miles an hour becoming south-southeast after midnight. Tomorrow, partly sunny with a high near 71 south wind 5 to 15 miles an hour with gust up to 20 miles an hour there is a 60 percent chance of precipitation mainly after 5 p.m new precipitation amounts of less than a tenth of an inch are possible and the weather yeah it's holding at 39 degrees downtown 56 percent relative humidity the wind is calm your border weight you're ready three hours downtown 20 minutes entry an hour and 30 minutes pedestrian eastport 45 minutes 10 minutes entry 45 minutes ready lane page two of the local news and the weather brought to you by david h west insurance services see david or jose for life insurance, health insurance, and Medicare supplemental coverage. David H. West, Insurance Services. It's time to get holiday ready with Ford. America's best-selling trucks are here, and capable SUVs are rolling out. Get great offers on the Ford that's right for you. Like F-Series, America's best-selling trucks for 44 years straight. And with Ford Explorer, America's all-time best SUV. Or come home in a Ford Bronco Sport. That's how you get holiday ready with Ford. Now get 0% financing for 60 months plus 1,000 bonus cash on a 2021 Ford F-150 or 2021 Ford Ranger. Only at your San Diego County Ford dealers. Not all buyers will qualify for Ford credit financing. 0% APR financing for 60 months at $16.67 per month for 1,000 finance, regardless of down payment. Not available on Raptor or Tremor. Residency restrictions apply. For all offers, take new retail delivery from an authorized Ford dealer stock by 1322. See dealer for qualifications and complete details. Based on 1977 to 2020 CY total sales. Based on IHS market 1946 current U.S. total new cumulative registrations for all vehicles identified as SUVs. And it's sports time. It is brought to you by 
Pioneers Memorial Healthcare District, an affiliate of the Scripps Health Network, working together to provide you the best care. NFL football action. Uh, did the Raiders even show up? Yeah, the Chiefs blew out the Raiders 48 <laughs> 9. Yeah. Not a good day. It was 35 3 at half. Saints beat up on. On the Jets, 30-9. Titans shut out the Jaguars, 20-0. Browns beat the Ravens, 24-22. Cowboys uh, slipped by the Washington Football Club, 27-20. Falcons topped the Panthers, 29-21. Seahawks over the Texans, 33-13. Broncos beat the Lions, 38-10. It was the Bengals losing in overtime. 49ers beat the Bengals 26-23. Another overtime game, the Buccaneers beat the Bills 33-27. Packers topped the Bears 45-30. And the Chargers whipped the Giants 37-21. Monday Night Football tonight on AM 1230, the Rams and the Cardinals. Pioneers Memorial Healthcare District, ready to serve you and your family for all your health care needs. Let our team of dedicated physicians guide you on your journey to better health. Pioneers is a recognized leader in health care and has more than 10 health centers and clinics throughout the Imperial Valley. When the need arises, don't hesitate to come and see us. We have services and locations in Calexico and Brawley and, of course, our award-winning hospital, Pioneers Memorial. For more information on all of Pioneers services, visit pmhd.org today. NBA action, Bucks beat the Knicks 112-97, Nets over the Pistons 116-104, Mavericks ran past the Thunder 103-84, Spurs pounded the Pelicans 112-97, Timberwolves topped the Trailblazers 116-111. to And the Lakers over the Magic 106-94. So uh, what else is going on in the world of sports? Former five-star recruit Quinn Ewers will transfer to Texas. The former Ohio State court hosted on social media Monday night. And uh, quarterback Bo Nix has walked away from Auburn football. He says he plans to transfer as a graduate. Nix, who started the past three seasons for the uh, Tigers, announced on yesterday that he plans to leave as a graduate transfer. Monday night football, yeah, we've got the Rams and the Cardinals, 4.30 this afternoon. That's it for Sports Time, brought to you by Pioneers Memorial Healthcare District. Log on to pmhd.org for more information about Pioneers. Since 1901, Real Printers Rocket Copy has provided the finest print and copying services from start to finish. When you choose Imperial Printers Rocket Copy, you can be confident in our expertise and personal attention to your project. We team of professional graphic designers ready to take your ideas and make them a reality. From promotional merchandise, full color brochures, blueprints, and high speed copies to business forms and everything else in between, Imperial Printers Rocket Copy offers dependable and affordable quality printing. Thank you for choosing locally owned and operated Imperial Printers Rocket Copy. We have convenient locations near you at 430 West Main Street and 100 South 11th Street in El Centro and 184 South Plaza in Brawley. And we've got a look at financial news and a brief look at the weather brought to you by Southwest Security, a locally owned company protecting you and your property. Southwest Security is also, also home of 24-hour uh, day post office boxes, Southwest Postal, 4th and Ohio, El Centro. Despite anxiety about inflation and the Omicron variant, the stock market is on for another banner year. And, uh, well, it's just a handful of stocks that are pushing it. According to research from Goldman Sachs, just five companies, Microsoft, Apple, NVIDIA, Tesla, and Google parent Alphabet have contributed 51% of the S&P 500 returns since April. 
Elsewhere, what's going on? Since time is postponing its big initial public offering after getting caught up in tensions between the U.S. and China, the Chinese artificial intelligence startup announced today it would delay its widely anticipated market debut in Hong Kong, where it had planned to raise up to $767 million. And uh, Biden's big infrastructure plan, which was passed last month, promises to create hundreds of thousands of new jobs, many of which won't require a college degree. But it's going to be an uphill battle. Yeah, because, according to sources, there are just not enough skilled workers for the infrastructure plan. The market read the Dow off 300 points, S&P 500 down 31, NASDAQ off 120 points, oil up 21 cents a barrel. Southwest Security Company is a locally owned security company protecting your property or your business and now offering live scan fingerprinting to the public. Plus, they added Southwest Postal with post office boxes you can access 24 hours a day, 365 days a year with shipping services too using DHL, UPS, and Fed. They're conveniently located at the corner of Hyle and 4th Street in El Centro. And if you need something notarized, they can do that too. You can count on Southwest Security and Southwest Postal for 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. Look for increasing clouds today with a high near 67 light winds. And they'll be out of the east-southeast about 5 miles an hour. Tonight, mostly cloudy with a 10% chance of showers after 4 a.m. An overnight low near 46. West-northwest wind about 5 miles an hour becoming south-southeast after midnight. Tomorrow, showers are likely. A 60% chance of showers after 4 p.m. It'll be partly sunny with a high near 71. South-southeast winds 10 to 15 miles an hour, gusting up to 20 miles an hour. 40 degrees, 55% relative humidity. Financial news and the weather brought to you by Southwest Security Services. We are the Imperial Valleys, AM 1230, KXO, El Centro, California. This is your home for original reporting. I'm Steve Kathan. Kentucky Governor Andy Bashir now says 64 tornado deaths are now confirmed in his state, and more are likely, with more than 100 still unaccounted for. We lost lives in at least eight counties, and at least 18 counties suffered damage. It's bad in the town of Mayfield, where residents and business owners with little left wonder what's next. You look around and you have so many people saying, how can we help? But it's almost like, where do you begin? CBS's Nora O'Donnell has spoken with Mayfield's mayor, who says it's going to be a long time before electricity and water service are restored. This is um, part of the harsh reality for thousands of this city's residents. Their homes crushed. This entire block, every home crushed. Their possessions blown miles away. And for many, their loved ones are gone. Also, buildings across this city, they are splintered apart. The mayor called the debris matchsticks. Many people we spoke to have nothing left, no savings, and now they need to rebuild everything. I'm Jim Crisul in Mayfield, Kentucky. Jimmy Taylor has been busy trying to salvage what he can from his parents' tornado-destroyed home. This is really the last thing these people need because the economy is so bad here, and it's just hard, hard to believe that something could do this much devastation, you know, it's just rough. His parents were hurt there in the hospital, but with a shrug of his shoulders, Taylor told me, quote, thank God they're still alive. Tornadoes also caused damage and more than a dozen deaths in Illinois, Missouri, Tennessee, and Arkansas. Along the West Coast, stormy weather is causing issues. CBS News meteorologist David Parkinson says it's not just rain. There is a lot of snow coming to the mountains of California through the end of the week. The potential for six, seven, eight, maybe even ten feet of snow in spots. There's a high avalanche risk because just of the way that this snowpack is. COVID infections are up 37 percent over the last week in the U.S. In Great Britain, there's word of the first link to the Omicron variant. Prime Minister Boris Johnson confirming the 
avenues as he toured a vaccination clinic. Sadly, at least one patient has now been confirmed to have died with Omicron. Just after two weeks since the first case was confirmed here, Johnson now says the Omicron variant will be the dominant strain in Britain by tomorrow. The reason he's now pushing to get boosters into everyone 18 and over by the end of this month. Vicki Barker, CBS News, London. Time Magazine's Person of the Year named this morning Tesla and SpaceX founder and CEO Elon Musk. Wall Street right now the Dow is down 310 points. This is CBS News. There's always something new under the sun. CBS Mornings, weekdays on CBS. Colleen, can you run back and wrap that? No, oh, you've got a customer. The holidays came early for the Hendrix Boutique. Yes, we'll be open even later when it gets... They'll need a temp fulfillment manager to tie up the holiday loose ends. I need some more help at the register. Somebody? Oh, share. Indeed can help them hire great people fast. I need Indeed. Indeed you do. Instant Match instantly connects you with quality candidates whose resumes on Indeed match your sponsored job description. Visit Indeed.com slash credit and get $75 towards your first sponsored job. Terms and conditions apply. I love being able to share with our family who's listening how much we all love State Farm Insurance. With surprisingly great rates, State Farm has saved us money with our car and home insurance. I mean, you're my wife. You know how much I love a great deal. So, of course, I'm going to love the great rates and great service at State Farm. It's good for my wallet and for my family. State Farm meets my needs. Plus, I get to control how and what I want for my budget. And I do it all from their award-winning mobile app. Surprisingly great rates. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. When close friends or family members have their hand out, it's hard to say no, but maybe that's the best answer. A new Bankrate.com survey finds 4 in 10 people who gave financial help to a family member or friend suffered negative consequences. Senior industry analyst Ted Rossman on what people experience. The most common is losing money. 38%. We also found that 23% who gave a financial helping hand ended up suffering a damaged relationship, 14% harmed their credit score, and 7% got into a physical altercation. Wendy Gillette, CBS News. It wasn't the kind of money Hollywood insiders were expecting for the opening of West Side Story of the movies. It took in just uh, over $10 million in weekend ticket sales. The Steven Spielberg film has been in the works for two years and has gotten critical acclaim. I'm Steve Kathan, CBS News. And now, more of the best oldies on the radio with Carol Buckley. Yeah, for some reason or another, you sound a little taller on radio. <laughs> AM 1230 KXO.